We're winning. We're beating our beer down. You gotta show it who's boss. Yeah, take that. Come on. Good boy. Feeling mineral water, Jake. You should have some water. That's Hawaiian punch. The annual renewal key. Incredible hole. Oh. Looks like that's face special. He looks really scared. Right? It's also a mini art. Hey Dan, where are we? We're in Denver, Colorado, in front of a live studio audience. In front of the Colorado Media School, which you can't see. Wait, maybe, if you move that way. The Colorado Media School! <laughs> we can see it. Okay. We've, we've had a very long day of drinking beer and going to several breweries. And so what are we going to do? We're going to come home and drink more beer. And we're going to drink more beer. Dan has a uh, Super Mario Brothers Odyssey hat on. It's Super Mario Cappy. Brothers? It's Cappy. Cappy the hat. Cappy the hat. Cappy the hat. We have eight beers in front of us. Right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. We have eight beers. Four of which are Avery because I, they're good. So we have to split it like down the middle. Avery and then everybody else. Pretty much. We got Bristol. We got... I don't even know what this one is. I don't know. Elevation either. Beer Company. Elevation, Crooked Stave. It's very and large. Crooked Stave and... Uh, Oscar. 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 Which I thought was Ozarka for a long time because yeah, it looks like that's Ozarka. a water company. My yes, dude. exactly. But it looks like Ozarka. Does it taste like Ozarka? Uh, close. <laughs> let's, let's get uh, into it. Let's get started with let's, the. Let's uh, tap this one off. <laughs> the the ten fifty. It did not cost ten dollars and fifty cents. It is Imperial Stout. I thought this was not a stout. I thought it was a lager. But apparently it's not. So, this one has a what? 4.38 4 on right. Beer Advocate. Yeah. So uh, this is 9,911. I think this is number three with like the top beers in Denver and in Colorado. I understand why it's called 1050 now. Is it? Is it 10.5? Got it. <laughs> smells good. I shouldn't have smelled it. Jesus, that is dark. Oof, that is the darkest stout I think I've ever seen in my life. Just that the way like you chocolate like it. milk. Oh my gosh. It looks like chocolate milk. It smells like chocolate milk. It really does look like chocolate milk. Damn, we're not supposed to taste it yet, bud. I need viewers. Oh, God, dude, that looks like motor oil. Mm-hmm. I'm going to put that right there and let it drain. <laughs> <laughs> just swallow it, Dan. Mm-hmm. Sometimes you just got to buck up and swallow. <laughs> <laughs> just swallow it. What are you? 
<laughs> why why are you having a problem swallowing the the foam? That's not helping me at all. Just swallow. Because it's all foam and it's air, so it's hard to swallow air. It's not that hard. As... It's not that hard, Dan. Come on, let's do this. Well, I've already tasted it, so. <laughs> you tasted foam. Which is basically beer. You said it was all air. <laughs> it's flavored air. Yeah. That's pretty good. Yeah, it's not bad. Mm -hmm. It's not the best stout I've ever had. I had a better stout today, and that was from... Uh... Left hand? Left hand. The pecan? It was that pecan one, yeah, that one was fucking delicious. Which you guys will see earlier or later in this video. Know. At some point in time during this video, you will see it. This is pretty good. Yeah, this is uh, a little heavy. Mm -hmm. I mean, the uh, foam hasn't even died down yet, and that's already been like a minute yeah. and a half. The stout, like, it's, it's got a nice, it's got a nice smell. It's almost like coffee, a little bit of chocolate. The taste is good. Yeah, overall, it finish, not bad. <laughs> it finishes a little bitter, but it's not that bad. That was a 1050. Now we're going with the, what is this one? The Crooked Stave. Crooked Stave Le Bret Dior. It's got a cool scorpion on it. Fine people at home. Brought to you by it. the Xbox Scorpio edition. God damn it, no it's not. No it's not, bad. no it's not. Tap it off, my man. Oh, yeah. And then, what, is this another stout? I feel like we got a lot of stouts. No, Your mom's a, a lot of stouts. This is a golden sour oak barrel. Okay. But what I've noticed in Colorado is that they have a lot of oak barrel okay. aged, and they have a lot of stout. Mm -hmm. It's kind of a nice golden color. Dude, I am horrible with pouring today. Look at that head. Oh, uh, it's probably these cups. Because <laughs> I poured that really slowly, and it's mostly head. Okay. There, our producers are dying in the corner and not really paying attention to us. I'm taking their job seriously. <laughs> I am taking said, this job very seriously. She said that you, you said she thought she said it stopped and she said your mom's a stout instead. <laughs> Alright then. It smells. It does smell real sour though. Mm -hmm. Oh. That's real sour. That's almost a cider dude. That's practically a cider. That is sour as hell. You looked at me like you thought I'd like it. You want to try no, it? I was gonna look at you and go, I prefer it to be inside her. <laughs> Get it, cider? I don't want to tolerate any windows on this fine family program, Dan. Fuck you! <laughs> <laughs> this is practically a sour. Do you want to taste it? Yeah, you, you would actually like this. It, it kind of hurts my jaw with how sour it is, so you'll love it. So pretty much for me, I'm not a I'm not a huge fan of this. That's, oh, we have a lot of beers here. That's way too that's way too sour. I'm not a huge fan of that. It's pretty much that's a twelve for me. That's a twelve okay. going all the way down. So like the smell of three, uh, the taste. I really I just I don't like ciders that much, and it tastes almost exactly like a cider. Tommy feel, I'm gonna give that a two. Smell, I'll give a two. Everyday drinkability, a one. That one good? Yes. Cool. What's your score, Dan? Uh, two on Tommy feel, two on smell, one on uh, erectile dysfunction, two on linger, two on taste, so a nine overall. That's 12. I liked it a little bit more than you did. I'm not huge on sours. Neither am I. I mean, it hey. tasted good, but I'm just I'm not a huge fan of sours. Let's Are you ready to this tap the next one off? Yeah, this one's the fucking Saison, and it's like, uh, what is it? Is it apricot, or is it peach? It has 10 Imperial beer units. 10 Imperial beer units. You have to go that way. Boom. It is a... Kettle Sour Saison Ale. A I fine pour. I'm not even sure what a Saison is, because I don't think we've ever had a Saison on this show. I'm going to pour a little bit more in here. The rest of it's probably going to stay in that bottle, because it's a huge bottle. It is a huge bottle. Alright. Look at the bubble, though. Yeah, that's a lot of bubbles. No, 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 no. Oh, and there it goes. You'll see it later, in post-production. Kind of tastes like it, too. 
If I were to drink a carpet cleaner, I would assume this is what it would taste like. Mm -hmm. That's not great. Yeah, I'm not a huge it's fan. It's soapy, almost. I think it's twos all the way down for me. That's the 20. That's... It's a 10. Oh, wait, no, it's right here. That's a 3.75 on Beer Advocate based off of three ratings. I was not a fan of that. And we have a whole fucking bottle of it. Yep. Now we get to pop this one off. It's got an actual I'll port. literally pop this one off. This is from uh, Bristol, right? Yeah, Bristol. This is a double of the lager. Pull it off. I didn't want it to fucking explode everywhere. Jeez. It's smoky. I think that's been laying in that that cooler for a little bit. Cause if there's cork still on there. Quite I don't awesome. know if I've ever had a double. Ugh. But we'll see. This is gonna fucking bubble up. And we'll try to put it in the very bottom of the thing. It's it's impossible not to get bubbles on that. I think it's all the fucking ridges. <laughs> it's rich for her pleasure. It's rich for bubbles. This fucking sucks, dude. It's all head. <laughs> I need different glasses. You're a different glass. This still has. Uh, what's his face? There we go. That's much better. It's a lot, but it's better. Do you want this? Let's see here. And this is just bristle brewing double. Awesome. Is it me in a hat? No, it's Gaston. No Why? one fucks like don't... Gaston. No. That's <laughs> nice little face. They're memeing. And they are memes, and they are filthy memers. Why do our producers always be filthy memers? Why do they do nice. filthy memers? Is it nice I'm, I'm going to give the smell of that a four. That's nice and smooth. Yeah, that's not bad. It's not bad at all. Drinkability? A three. Linger? A three. Taste? A two. Tell me feel a two. Mm -hmm. Um, like two across the board on tummy feel so far. Yeah, you know I'm gonna go three all the way down. Three all the way down. That's a fifteen for me. Uh, so mine would be a thirteen then. Hmm. No, uh, fourteen. Yours would be a fourteen. Yeah. Uh, two, four, ten, fourteen. Yep, fourteen. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'll live. Alright, Let's Dan. tap off another one. Which one's this one? I think this is the one you got. Uh, Promiscuous. Promiscuous. Promiscuous? Promiscuous? Probiscus? Probiscus. Prohibiscus. Prohibiscus. You know what else is Prohibiscus? Flowers. It's one of the ones that are uh, brewery s exclusive. Was it? Oh yeah, actually yeah. it is. It looks like honey. It does look like honey. It looks and like it, straight honey. It just looks like I poured a glass of honey. Mm -hmm. I mean, it's a little bit more liquidy, but it's a glass the of honey. The cap is making my face look yellow. And that is very sour smelling. More sours. Is this one of the brewers or only? Yeah, this is one of the only. This one of the exclusives. Which this one is that the, one called? The Promiscus. Yeah, that's the one the brew. The lady at the desk said was her favorite. Was it? Ooh, with the ship on it. That's a little cool ship. Have you taste it? That's sour. That's very sour. I could taste that barrel too. It it's a like, sour barrel. 
It's like if you put like lemon on the inside of a barrel and then you licked it. It's kind of what kind of what it tastes like. That's really sour. It's Taylor, bad, though. you would like it. <sighs> Fuck. <clears throat> All right, Dan, what are you going to give that score, Dan? Uh, I gave it a two on tummy feel, a three on smell, a two on erectile dysfunction, one on linger, and two on taste. Overall, a ten. Like, that's got a really good flavor. It's just, like, it's so sour. It's so sour that I wouldn't be able to drink more than half of this bottle. Yeah, like, you can probably do it with, like, one bottle. and be good. You can have the rest of it if you want. Oh, hell yeah. No, that's, that was hers. I'm giving her the rest of... I was gonna put mine in there. Yeah, same. Sure, you want to try That is... S -s 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 sour. Well, I mean, you know. Next one up. Batter this up. is the Uncle Jacob's Stout. Tap this shit off. <laughs> Anytime Dan leans down, it covers his face, but he has the eyeballs on his head, so it just looks like Hattie's like taken over. It's Cappy Taylor. My bad. Cappy will come for your this soul. This is a professional set, and I want you to be professional, please. Oh, good for you. Damn, that is... That's almost orange. Holy shit. Seriously, the search function on PR Advocate is absolutely terrible. 4.42. A 4.42 with 2,748 ratings! That is dark. That's that dark. is motor oil. That is, it looks like motor oil. Like, it's almost Used looking. motor oil. But let's see what it says on the side. Jacob, our sixth great grand uncle is credited to the first distiller to label his whiskey bourbon. He built this distillery at Bourbon County, Kentucky. Interesting. I guess this is bourbon this? barrel? Yep. Everything's in, in barrels in old Colorado. This smells like molasses. It does. And molasses doesn't particularly smell great. I'm kind of afraid to drink this. It's going to be heavy. It's going to be really heavy, and it's going to sit in my stomach and feel absolutely terrible. That's pee good. It's pee good. It's pee good. It's pee good. It's pee good. Oh, I thought you said pee good. Like, like pee good? As in pretty good? No, as in P-E-E. -E. urine. Like urine good? <laughs> Man, this is urine good. You not like it, did you? No, not I'm at not, all. I'm not a fan of it either. Which I is shitty, because you love stouts. I love stouts. The bourbon's too much. The bourbon's way oh. too strong. That is not settling in with stouts. This is one of the highest rated beers in, in Colorado. And this is not mixing well with all the other beers in my stomach right now. Jake, we've had now probably like 20 different beers today. Yeah, we've had a shit ton of beers. We've had a shit ton of beers this entire week. They're all still just like mingling on my stomach and they're like, fuck you, man. <sighs> I'm not a fan of that. It's so disappointing to me. I think next up is Tweak, oh which is an IPA, which is going to be a little bit lighter than this. Uh, That's two's all the way down for me. That's 10. That's a 10. That's not great. A one on tummy feel. Honestly, a one on smell and a one on drinkability. Two on linger and one on taste. I did not like it at all. Five, that's a six. That's a solid six beverage for me. It's oh, not man. great. It's, just, it's really disappointing, honestly. I was really high, hoping for that one to be really, really good. What? Are you guys... I can't remember. Do you guys go to five or ten? One out of five or one out of ten? One out of five. five. Oh, okay. And then we have a, a, a cumulative score with all five categories. Our stealth score. Yeah. score. Stealth. 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 I just made it up, Taylor. My bad. <laughs> it's an acronym. <laughs> it's art. Ever heard of it? 
Put that over there. I know, you, I, sure can. I, know your, I know your tummer's doing a hurt right now. That tummy feel's not good for you. Did you rate that tummy feel a one? In fact, I did. Yeah. I feel like I'm about to vomit, man. We're going to make fun of for our tummy feel. Are you going to be okay? Maybe. Got two more to get there. Okay, we can get it. We can power through this shit. Why is it every time we do an episode, you and the other producer are constantly just sending memes? Technically, we're actually sending gifts. <laughs> Still memes. And you just filthy memers. Filthy. Are you going to be okay? You all right? My gut's really hurt. <laughs> luckily, we don't, luckily, we don't have another stout, unless that's a stout. Like, so. It's a sour. Oh, cool, it's a sour. Cool, 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 cool. Nope. To the, to, the sorry, viewer, to the viewers at home. I feel like I'm about to piss up my ass. <laughs> Why don't you take a break? And it is not going to be fun. Damn. Courtney, do you really want to leave before that? <laughs> is this another stout? This is another stout, Dan. I'm real sorry. I'll be okay. I'll power. You have to do it for 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 I'll art. I'll do it for the views. Do it for art. If you vomit, we'll get a lot of views. <laughs> if I vomit on you. <laughs> this one smells better. I'll be the judge of that. That's not amazing smell. How is Austin so good and Colorado so mediocre? Well, it's funny is that Denver is like a huge, like Denver and Boulder are huge beer towns. What's funny is I think we just tried all the good ones in the brewery. I kind of think we did. I really think we did. Because <laughs> like, literally ones. everything we had at the breweries was like really light and good, tasty. That's and like all is just dark and dirty and horrible on the tummy feel. So the last time we gotta do, it doesn't taste great. It doesn't smell great. <laughs> it doesn't taste great. Oh god. Sour again. I know. Yeah, the sours are better. This, the stouts are super heavy. On to the next one, Cappy. That's much better. That is much better. It's a lot better. It's a coffee stout. Actually, it's pretty good. It's really good, actually. That'd be really good with some ice cream. Oh hell yeah, dude. That's almost like a prairie bomb level of, like, I want to make a fucking milkshake out of that. There is ice cream in the fridge slowly melting. <laughs> Tummy feel. I'm going to give that a three. The it's smell. A, it's a 15 for me. The smell, I'll give it to drinkability to the linger, a three, and the taste. I'll give a four on that taste, actually. Yeah, it's a really good taste. I four, like the Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. Fourteen. How is it whenever we went to Avery, every single one we tasted was, like, fucking amazing, and now we got, like, they're, apparently they're four best ones, and then it's like, meh. Meh. This is good. Because the best ones they kept in-house. This is a really good. This is really good. I like this one. Was this another one? No, the last one's another one that's uh, exclusive. Oh, yeah. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Please no. <laughs> God, I've got to down this. Daniel. What? You can edit it out. Yeah, your racism. Yeah, I can totally edit that out. <laughs> yep. I have to down this because I have nowhere else to put it. Yeah, we still need to put another beer in there. Chug, 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 chug. <coughs> you can taste that bourbon. That is not a chugging beer. You're right. They have well. We have one more, Dan. What? I I want to die. <laughs> Jake, they're all stouts. I thought just I'd be like excited. In, just like in, in Austin, they were all IPAs. <coughs> I thought I thought I could handle. I thought I'd be excited for like all stouts, but it's just too much. Ugh, God damn, that is a one beer beer. Most definitely. We got one left. Do you want to tap it off, Dan? Sure, I can tap us off. Cool to thing. end this bitch. Oh, Dan. My tummer's doing a... doing a hurt to me. Uh, you're telling me. I, I don't think I've ever, like, had such labored breathing out of just drinking beer. That's how I felt the past couple days about just drinking nothing but beer. Last 
also have Dan's little drum. No, I think Dan's about to like Vaughn? pass out. Oh shit, that's red. That's pretty. I think I'm gonna like this. Please let me have a taste of it too. Of course. Look at that nice crisp color. It's like a nice like cherry color. Or like strawberry. That's really good. That looks nice. That does look nice. Ooh. That smells like That smells real sour, but also like it smells like rock candy. This is a 3.99. That's it? How is that only a 3.99? With 10 ratings. It also says it's discontinued, but that is false. It's uh, exclusive only to Avery Breweries. This is kind of delicious. It's like melon almost. It's really delicious. It is really good. It tastes like a watermelon jelly. Monster. That's what it is. Jelly, right? It's watermelon. It's a That's jelly what it is. Nature. That's what I just said. I said melon. Well, I didn't say it's watermelon. Melon. Whenever I think melon, I think of like a honeydew for whatever reason. You don't really like watermelon. That is water. That tummy, feel, that tummy feel is going to be a three. That everyday drinkability will also have to be a three. The linger, I'll give a four. I'm used to it. The taste, a four. Five, eight, 19, 11. It's a 19 for me. It's a 19. That is a 19 for me as well. That is really damn good. I enjoy that a lot. I do enjoy that a lot. I, apparently we did save the best for last. We did. I don't even know we get it. It's delicious. Jake, I'm not looking forward to that no-no beer cup. It just looks like a straight <coughs> cup of motor, uh, motor oil. Dan, I've literally had nightmares about that. Because <laughs> I gotta pour the, or you gotta pour that in there. I can't mm -hmm. chug. I can't chug anything, or I'll, I will literally vomit. <sighs> um, that's mostly stout. It is mostly stout, and we don't have a single damn thing to stir this with. Well, I guess we're not staring it. Where's the, the the cap for this? I threw it somewhere. Uh, I don't know if I would trust it though. No. Yes, that's it. Just throw it back. Good throw. Don't shake it. Just stir. If you shake it, it'll explode. I'm playing the most dangerous game. Yeah, I don't want to have to clean stout, stout af, out of a fucking hotel carp. <clears throat> it's bad. No more, Dan. Dan, I want to drink this and be done. <laughs> oh, hey, I'm playing the most dangerous game. You gotta break a few eggs. It's kinda, that doesn't make any sense, my man. Yeah, that makes really no doesn't sense. Make any sense. Your mom makes no I sense. Where you play with eggs. Well, she said. a good point. What game do you play with eggs? I remember, I remember reading that, uh, that You know like that Easter game where you get the uh, egg <laughs> on the spoon and you have to like do the little relay race down to the other side? You always lost, didn't you? No, I threw my egg at somebody. <laughs> Damn. I mean, they give it to you on a spoon. It's like a little trebuchet. Damn. So you did that. <laughs> Damn. Dan, give it to me. It's gonna be rough, Dan. It's gonna be I'm rough. Gonna but give it, it to her. I'm gonna drink it first. Give it to me in the cup. Uh, just, just the sound of that didn't sound good. Uh, I don't want to drink this, Dan. <laughs> it's too heavy. The camera ran out of memory, and the laptop that had the audio for this episode was stolen, so that's the end of the video. I'm in a fucking hat. I'm in a hat. So am I.